Okay. Historically, coronaviruses, uh, vaccines for coronaviruses have had a terrible safety record. Uh, there is a condition known as disease enhancement due to pathogenic priming. And this was discovered in vaccinated animals in past vaccine safety studies when they did conduct vaccine safety studies on animals on coronavirus vaccines where vaccinated animals got more serious disease after being vaccinated and then when they acquired an infection from the wild type vaccine, more of animals got serious infections, serious conditions, and more animals died. In my peer-reviewed research paid for the citizens of the United States of America through donations to IPAC, prior to the development of any COVID vaccines, I found that all but one of the proteins in the SARS-CoV-2 virus have what we call unsafe epitopes, right? Which are parts of proteins that are capable of causing immune conditions, autoimmune conditions, and immune responses against proteins in our own body. This is peer-reviewed research and I'll be happy to provide the press with reference after this. About a third of the proteins that might be targeted by autoimmune conditions by SARS-CoV-2 viral proteins, either through infection or injection, target the immune system. But from the start, it looks like this virus has evolved the ability to attack our immune system as part of its disease-causing capacity. This pathogenic priming, I, pre I predicted in my study, which parts of the human body would likely be most affected by pathogenic priming. And now studies by medical physicians, by medical teams around the world are confirming my predictions. This is not simply a respiratory virus with, with respiratory uh, symptoms. This affects many tissues across the body and there's some grave concern if you're going to get infected. But where's the grave concern if you're going to be injected with these same proteins? Not a single, to my knowledge, not a single vaccine manufacturer took heed of my warning to remove those unsafe epitopes from the vaccines before they formulated their vaccines. In spite of being emailed my study with a plea to please consider taking out those unsafe